Hello, teacher Jocelyn. Hello, hello. How are you today? Uh, I have a little bit uh, tired. Okay, why? Uh, because uh, today I have a exam. Okay, how did it go? They go to be good. It went good? Yes. Okay, it use went. your past tense correctly. It went well. It went good. It went well would yeah. probably be the better one to say. Yes, of course. Are you okay? Are you ready for the lesson? Or not really? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Okay, unit seven, achievements. What is achievements, Kelly? Achievements? Achievements, what? Achievement. Oh, I can. Achievements. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know this. Hmm? I don't know this word. Okay, I can't see you. I'm not okay. sure you're focusing. All right. Achievements is when you do well at something. When you do well at something. Well, as something. Do you not understand? Okay, achievement is when you do well as something. Yes, when you do a good job. For example, if you get an A plus in a test, if you get a certificate from school for good work. Okay, achievements. Okay, lesson one, the arts. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Verdi's operas. Verdi's operas. Picasso's paintings. Picasso painting. Good job. Okay, let's go have a look. If I'm trying to see, let me see if I can show you. Yes. Here we go. Okay. So this is Verdi. Verdi. I think this person is so famous. World fame was famous. Yes, he's world famous. Yes. Okay, so he wrote operas. All right, so he was the reason why there were operas and shows. Okay, then we have Picasso. Picasso's paintings. Yes, Pablo Picasso. And wow. he was famous for his paintings. All right, he was an I artist. Love, yes, I love painting too. Mm. Wow. So he did very odd stuff. They look, yeah, they look so beautiful. I don't creative. Think, I actually, I don't think his paintings were beautiful, but I thought it was like very different. Uh, it makes yeah. you look at it and wonder like what is going on, you know? Yes.
Okay. So two famous people. Then we have the famous, famous of all time, William Shakespeare. Shakespeare's, Shakespeare's plays. Good job, William Shakespeare. So he was very famous. I don't know if you've learned about him at school. I learned about uh, him at school. He's I don't famous. know this person. Okay. William Shakespeare. You never what? heard of him? Yes. Okay. He wrote plays like uh, Romeo and Juliet. Uh, uh, Hamlet. Okay, so he he oh, wrote plays. Juliet. Wow. Okay. He wrote plays. He wrote poems. Okay, he had Hamlet, Macbeth. Um, which one was the other famous one? Juliet, uh, I have ever uh, I heard think, that. Okay, no, he didn't do, I'm not sure if he made, wait, I'm not sure if he did the play Romeo and Juliet. Let me check. Juliet. Maybe it's another famous Romeo and Juliet. Romeo and Juliet. Oh, yes, it was him. Okay, so Romeo and Juliet, it's like a love story. Wow. All right. So, Moses. so he wrote this play, this wrote about Romeo and Juliet. Wow. Romeo and Juliet. Well, his plays were very popular. His books were very popular. Wow. I don't have ever seen it. You've never seen it? Oh, oh that's, yeah. that's interesting that you've never seen it. It's very popular. Yes, of course, but uh, I have ever heard the name is Juliet in Remail, Remail, but I don't know this is, it was a film. Huh? I don't I understand don't what you're saying. <laughs> yes, I don't know the Remo, a two person Remo and Shulamit. But what? I have, yeah, but I have ever hear the name of the Juliet. Okay, I don't understand what you're saying. Can you please say it again? Okay, I will. <laughs> so you've never heard about Romeo and Juliet. You've never heard about Verdi's operas and um, Pablo uh, Sico? I, I've heard the name Juliet. Okay, but just because you heard that name Juliet doesn't mean you know yes. about Romeo and Juliet. I don't know the Remo Romeo. Last slot for up to 12 hours. Filiaden. <sighs> William Shakespeare, one of the greatest authors of all time, was born in Stratford-upon-Avon, England. His actual birth date is uncertain, but most scholars believe he was born on or near April 23rd, 1564. We think he may have been educated in the King's School at Stratford because that would have been typical for a child with a father who was an alderman. What we do know is that he didn't go to university. 
We have a marriage record for Shakespeare to Anne Hathaway in 1585. We also have baptism records for a daughter and a set of twins. And we also know that his son, Hamnet, one of the twins, died. Shakespeare moved to London in the late 1580s okay. by, his son, by the early 15. His son, Hamlet, is the one that died, and he wrote a book about it. We know him. he's writing, and we know that he's acting. Okay. By 1597, Shakespeare had authored 15 of the 37 plays attributed to him, including Romeo and Juliet, yep. Comedy of Errors, and The Merry Wives wow. of Windsor. People think of William Shakespeare as an artist, a playwright. He was a pretty good businessman. In 1599, he built the largest open-air amphitheater in London, the Globe Theatre. He was an entrepreneur, he knew his market, he knew how to cater to that market, he made shrewd real estate investments. Shakespeare's company, the Lord Chamberlain's Men, changed its name to the King's Men when King James became its patron in 1603. This was a mark of exceptional prestige. The different wow. types of Shakespeare plays, they're separated into histories, comedies, tragedies, and then later on, tragic comedies. Shakespeare's phrases, the ways he used words, are so common that people often get mixed up and can't remember if they came from the well, Bible or from Shakespeare. So My grandmother used yeah, to say when something word. bad happened that these were the slings and arrows of everyday life. She was not an educated woman, and she didn't go to Shakespeare plays. She didn't get that one from the Bible. What scholars call Shakespeare's middle period from 1595 to 1605 included such classic comedies as Midsummer Night's Dream, As You Like It, Twelfth Night, and Much Ado About Nothing. He also produced Hamlet, Othello, and Macbeth during this period. Right at the cusp where Shakespeare begins to write Lear, it tips into what we could call the later Shakespeare. And this period produces Lear, Anthony and Cleopatra, Tempest, Winter's Tale, Pericles, Cymbeline. Shakespeare wrote great stories. For example, one of the stories... Okay, so he wrote, he wrote plays, and he also did poems. Um, Let's go to one of his poems. If I can find one of his poems. Okay, love. Tell me where is fancy bread, or in the hearts, or in the head? How begot, how nourished? Reply, reply, it is engendered in the eyes, with gazing fed and fancy dies, in the cradle where it lies. Let us all ring fancy knell. It'll, I'll begin it. Ding dong, bell, all ding dong, bell. Wow. Okay, so that is a poem about love that he did. So great. Let me not to the marriage of true minds admit in, in oh, sorry, impediments. Love is not love, which alters when it alteration finds or bends with the remover to remove oh no it is an ever fixed mark that look on tempests and is never shaken it is the star to every wandering bark who is worth unknown although his height be taken loves not times full though rosy lips and cheeks. Within his be bending circles, compass come. Love alters not with his brief hours and weeks, but bears it out even to the edge of doom. If this be error and upon me proved, I never write, nor no man ever loved. Okay, so, there's a few poems that he's done, all right? Yeah. Romeo and Joliet, like the poetry as well we've got. Wow. 
Okay, so we got that one. Romeo and Juliet. Romeo. Four. Beethoven's symphonies. Five. <laughs> Michelangelo's sculptures. Okay. Six. Beethoven's sympathies. Four. Beethoven's symphonies. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Beethoven's symphonies. Very interesting. Okay, so he created music. He wrote music. Wow, yes. All right, let's go to our best friend. YouTube, our best friend. What? What's friend? Let's have a look. Wow. Mm. Right now, I don't want Chloe. Trolley, wow, trolley, chill, trolley, something else, something, mm. um, I don't think. Five. Michelangelo's sculptures. So he created music, wrote music. Six. Yes. I've four. Balanchine's four. ballets. Beethoven's, Beethoven's symphonies. symphonies. Five. Five. Michelangelo's, Michelangelo's sculptures. What now? I don't hear anything. You know, what do you mean you don't hear anything? Did you not hear the music? No, I don't hear the word. Did you listen to Yes, this? I can okay. hear this. That's fine. I don't know what you're going on about. Sculptures. Okay. Michelangelo sculptures. Michelangelo sculptures. Michelangelo's sculptures. Beethoven's Scott. Sympathies. Beethoven's Symphonies. Okay, so Michelangelo was very famous for his sculptures. Wow, yes. But I, but mm -hmm. I don't know it. Okay, Kelly, just give me a chance. Okay. Yes, it's you, just relax. Okay, Michelangelo was very pop 
um, he was very popular. He was very famous. He was famous for his sculptures. Okay, so he's very famous for his sculptures. Yeah, so beautiful. Very beautiful, very beautiful, yeah. So he's very famous for his sculptures. I think when uh when he made it, it looks so difficult, right? No. It's not about being difficult or easy. He was an artist. He was very good at making sculptures. Yes, I see. So it's not about whether it's difficult or whether it's easy or what it is. He's just very famous for his sculptures. And he, he was very, okay, he, he was born in 1475. He died in 1564. Okay, he was, in, wow. he was born in Italy. So he is now dead. Okay, long time ago, wow. but he was very famous. He was a famous artist, very well known for sculpturing. Yeah. Six, six. Balanchines, Balanchines, ballets. Okay, Balanchines, ballets. Balanchines, ballets. Right, so this. One was known for their ballets. Yeah. What now? No. I feel like you're not patient today. Patient? Yes, you're not, you don't have patience today. Patient. You're in a rush. Yes. Uh. Okay, wow. Balanchine. Okay, so he was very, he was famous for his ballet. I All think right. so. Hmm? I think so. Oh. I'm telling you that he was famous for the ballet. Okay, so not I think so. He was. We know this because we, 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 we've seen it. We've read about it. We've studied it. Okay, he was famous for his ballet. Mm.
Uh, he was a choreographer, okay. so he was very good at ballet, showing them how to dance, letting them dance to things, right? Yes. Okay, this is some of his famous work. All right, so if you have time, go look it up on YouTube, go have a look. All right, spend some time looking at it. Okay. Okay, good. All right, whose paintings are displayed here? Uh, is Picasso's painting are displayed here. Good job. Okay, can you read for us? What did we learn today? Okay, number one, Verdi's operas. Number two, Picasso's paintings. Number three, Shakespeare's plays. Number four, Beethoven's symphonies. Beethoven's symphonies? Beethoven's symphonies. Number five. Oh. Michael Angelo's I... sculptures. Michael Angelo's sculptures. Mm -hmm. Page Ballet. 65. Angelo's sculptures. Six. Balanchine's ballets. Okay, did you hear that? Balanchine's ballets. Ba Break it up. Balanchine's ballets. 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 Okay. Michelangelo's sculptures. Michelangelo's sculptures. Balanchine's ballets. Balanchine's ballets. Ballet. Balanchine relates. Okay. I Number hope five, you... Michael Angelo's sculptures. I hope you took a picture of this so that you can, if you have some free time, go read up about all this. Yes. It's of... all the difficult work. It's not difficult. It's just like not enough time to go to through every person. That. All right, let's see. Page 65. Word. See, listen and say, then practice. Verdi's operas are performed here. Picasso's paintings are displayed here. Perform. An opera. A play. A symphony. A ballet. Display. A painting. A sculpture. Perform. Performed. Performed. Display. Displayed. Displayed. One. Verdi's operas are performed here. Two. Picasso's paintings are displayed here. Three. Shakespeare's plays are performed here. Four. Beethoven's symphonies are performed here. Five. Michelangelo's sculptures are displayed here. Six. Balanchine's ballets are performed here. Okay. Uh, I don't hear you. All right, let's connect the words to the correct meaning. So opera, okay. what, what is opera? Opera. Oh. Opera. Form an intimate for 
character in the play them symphony play speak through okay. set the art and what Symphony perform that that symphony. that that is that right yes okay what is the opera let's read opera is a musical play in which most of the words are sung or play the music or this type. Right? They sing like very deep, long words and make it sound very extravagant. Sim yes. Okay, symphony. 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 Is Symphony is a long piece of music for an orchestra. Orchestra. Oh, orchestra, usually with four movements. What is an orchestra? Oh, it's, it's the first time I hear this word. Orchestra. What? It's a group of instruments, right? Like I showed you. I showed you Beethoven's orchestra with the symphony with the violins, piano, flutes. Okay, it's a whole group of different mus like musical instruments. Got it? Okay. Do you understand? Yes or no? Don't say yes if you don't understand, please. It like violin, piano is the something else, right? Okay. All right. So it yeah. So okay. It's when you have a lot of different musical instruments together. All right. Okay. Like we saw in that video. Like we saw in the video. Look here. You see? They've got violin, piano, drums. Uh, cello, like a lot of different musical instruments. Okay. All right, got it. Okay. I hope you're making notes. Yes. Next one, okay. ballet. What is this? Ballet. Ballet is a type of dancing where carefully or organized. 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 Movements, yeah. Organized movements. Organized. Organized. Movements. Movements tell a story or express an idea, or a theater, theater work that uses this type of dancing. Food sculpture. Sculpture is the art sculpture. of sculpture. sculpture. Sculpture is the art of forming solid objects that re repair and a thing. Represent. You re represent a thing. 
person, idea, etc. 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 Out of a material such as wood, clay. Oh, clay. Good play. What is a play? Play is perform an entertainment or a particular character in a play film. Okay, play. Perform an entertainment or a particular character in a play film. Okay. Any questions? Any words you don't understand? Rather ask me than me. Be stuck, 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 stuck. <laughs> yeah. Are there any questions? Any no. words that you're not sure about? Did you write it no. down? Did you take a picture? Yes. <laughs> oh, good work. Good job. Homework. Yes. Homework. Simple present tense. What is simple present tense? Simple present tense. Oh. Simple parent present tense. Is uh mm, present tense. Simple present tense. What is it? Why am I waiting so long? Um, something that something happens that now, right? Present tense is it's happening now. Some of the happening now. Yes. Okay, I see. Okay, so I sent you your homework. Please do your homework yes. and so I send it back to me. Yes, I will give it soon. Oh, welcome to iTunes. What? No, ignore that. Oh, I can't take it back. Uh, this computer. Okay, there we go. Homework is sent. Okay, so try to do your homework. It will help. Okay, we know today. It was a lot of new things. Not these different okay. famous people. Try open the. Yes. I'll try. Can I go read up about these famous people? Yes. All right. Good work. Okay, I will see you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you bye -bye, on Kelly. Wednesday. Bye-bye. Get some rest. Don't be too tired. Bye-bye. Yeah. <laughs> see you Wednesday.